Uh, that thing just got more terrifying, didn't it? Okay, let me try one more time here. Huh. I have no idea what I did different. I guess hitting X on it. I thought I did. Oh. Hi, how you doing? Okay, then. Not sure what that was supposed to do, but... Oh, you were an ambush. Oh, that's a pretty bad ambush. Didn't work. And I did all this for... Slimes. Are you... Blocking? No. Huh. I well, we got cash, I guess. That's something. Uh, yeah, let's just go with the regular attacks. Not the fastest, but I think they're a little bit faster than the specials. There you go, Sue. Okay, cool. All right, we won. It gives us 16 bucks. Everyone skills up. Question is, do I want to go through here, take the long way, get back to the door, or do we want to? Go back for that sad ambush and make sure I didn't miss anything. Yeah, I think I want to go for the sad ambush. Make sure I didn't go past some cash or something. Not because there's a bunch of slimes that are... Oh, that one's all alone. He's separated. I... I'll let you be. Oh, no. Well, guess he's an orphan. Unless he's mixed up there. Ah, uh, papa, get rid of you. And you. Uh, if only the... Justin could at least take one of them out. And we could just kind of clear it up a little faster. Well, if he keeps getting the, uh, the axe to level up, it should help with the strength. I was trying to think, was there meant... I don't know if this is just this game, but there's not a lot of games that I can think of right now that when you just do an attack, they do more than one attack. Like, I don't know if this was like one of the first ones. Like, speaking in this game was kind of rare. Like I said, for the PlayStation, not many games had voice acting. But, multiple attacks. Oh, yeah, that's not maybe the rarest thing, but. You would just assume that Justin would just maybe attack once, but have them do two? Eh, something. Okay, well... I know I didn't say it, but I actually am a wee bit lost. Uh, we saw that. That is the left, because we want to be here. Okay. I found myself. But how do we get up there? By murdering this slime. Which might possibly be, be the last enemy here. Which is not on purpose. I, I'm trying to not murder everything, but... Uh, loot is loot. Gotta get the loot. I mean, get some free experience. If you don't like any of those excuses, eh, just... I'm rusty. Give me a moment and then I'll 
I'll get a little faster. Or I'll learn magic to clear out the monsters a bit faster and then don't have to worry about it because they're all dead. But still, the random encounter is not that bad. It, you can actually try to avoid the enemies. It's just... Do you step aside to let them run, or do you just cause the trouble? Uh, yeah, no, okay. See, it's not a total wipeout. There's still enemies here. I'm just being dumb right now. I completely forgot where to go. One massive circle for me, and I keep going around and around instead of getting off. Okay. Kind of just trail it up here. Boom. There you go. I think. No. Oh, that's for that treasure I found. Okay, yeah, I'm just... Ah, oh, let's see. Okay, there it is. I don't know. It's just something about the the building and stuff. It just kind of blends together, and I just get utterly lost sometimes. Okay. It doesn't help that I fall off things either. Recover. Okay. Back at it. Alright, new look, new stuff, blue or green, check out blue, hmm, oh, very uh, trippy I guess. And then we have green. Okay, well I think this will just take us... Yeah, alright, so this is the puzzle. And the puzzle is telling me I'm doing it wrong. Alright, so what happens if we just hit green this time? So then that might bring back it in blue, which it did. And then do we get a path to green? We do, but if we just hit this. That takes us to new. Rolly heads. Welcome, he who holds the spirit stone. Welcome, he who holds the spirit stone, symbol of the promise between the humans and the spirits. Who... who are you? 
I am Liette of Alent. I have lived through and inherited the history of Angelo. What? W what's going on? Ah! We're, we're gonna fall! Don't be scared. This is the land you live in, when seen from the height of the stars. Come. Please tell me. What were you seeking when you opened the door? Gee, you're, uh, sort of putting me on the spot. Hey! How did you know that I have a spirit stone? All power is born from the light of the spirit stone. Without it, the door of Angelo does not open. But Angelo is just a mythical world. It is no myth. The stone that you hold is the ancient symbol of the promise between the humans and spirits. Look. A world created by an eternal promise between the light of the spirits and the wings of the Icarians this is the world of Angelo. The light of the Icarians and the grace of the spirits will not wane, lest all of the stars sparkling in the sky turn to embers. Ever since receiving the blessing of the spirits, the people unyoked themselves of the original restrictions and began to walk along the path of evolution. The light of the Icarians and that of the Spirit Stones are the symbols of peace in this world.
and nothing bad will happen. No military will come after you. Everyone will be singing praises. Not like the enemy. Not like any enemies just gonna be waiting right here to ambush you and just take the stuff off you. That's a clever way to trap them. You wouldn't think that. Look at this guy, he was all like... Not intimidating, but he was... Uh, inspiring to his soldiers. Down to murder children, though. But, you know, he's so gosh darn good looking, isn't he? Ah, huh. so that's his trap, uh, giant rock bird. Alright, well, let's see what good old V-Slash does. Uh, Sue... Uh, yeah, just chuck Puffy at it. Yeah, no, he was pretty much down to just block away children and never be seen again. It's kind of hard to really point a finger on Mullen sometimes. I kind of forget if he's a... If he's truly bad or he's just like in a situation. I can't really remember. And, I mean, he did cut Justin. Uh, he is down to cut at least. Nice try. Uh... At this point, I just want to see Ra Ra just once. It's just a very catchy song that heals. Although I probably should have waited till he did that. Oh, two. Never mind. What do you got? This is nothing. 
There you go. Be at peace. Or in pieces. Ooh, but the money. Uh, that's the most money I got, other than killing those little monsters. At least Mullen enjoyed himself. He didn't get a chance to murder a child and lock it away. But still, it was the pleasure of attempting to murder the child that brought the, the enjoyment to him. Uh, yeah, see, he, this guy agrees with me. Just, if, just didn't say nothing. They could maybe do better than lean. Although Lean can talk and not sound like a sociopath, so... Doesn't really put them all in the best spot, does it? Uh, da -da -da. Okay, I think this is just repeating themselves from last time. Still, great army. Don't, well, I guess they're not aware of the children sneaking in, but you'd think they'd be on the up and up to kind of stop this great escape from happening. All right, let's see. Hmm. And it does not look like it'd be fun to be working on the dome, does it? Who's always putting him into check? <laughs> yeah, he's considerate to his men. But if you're a child and know government secrets, you're going to prison for a long time. But it's fine, he'll enjoy himself if you resist. I'm just like I get what they're trying. I know he's trying to give respect to Justin for being like, "Oh, you outsmarted me," but he really does come out like a. I'm just gonna kill a bunch of kids if they know too much. So they do know him, that's why he has a portrait. Must have missed that. Although, what he has to do for Sergeant Mio is not very explained. Could be doing some terrible things to him. Unspeakable horrors. But hey, a save. Welcome, welcome. So we're getting the heck out of here. So you can uh, get to the new place. Guards are still pretty chill, not trying to murder two children, so that's always good. And if I can, yep, there's the exit. I think we can just go, yep. No more monster hunting for me. Shame, I can def definitely want to hit something right now. Okay. But 
How's the cash situation looking? Fantastic. Very, very good. Huh. Can you go hiking? Uh, tempted to talk to everyone again. I was kind of thinking maybe it was the the kid's soldier, but maybe uh, not related. Yeah, sure. Don't know what's in an inventor's house. Hmm. Hair dryer that burns your hair. And a cutting board <laughs> that cuts everything. That doesn't seem like it's working as it should. Okay, well, nothing there. I was kind of hoping to find the item shop, though. A bit lost again. Nope, that's it. Okay, perfect. Uh, ooh. Okay, we definitely have options here. I think I want to... No, I can't store just yet. Okay. Uh, metal bat's pretty good. But I do want the sword. Ah, uh, right. Uh, okay, I think we're still good if I come back. I'm... Don't want to sell anything, but I think we can store stuff in his house. That way I don't lose anything, and I can get rid of some of these banana seeds. Okay, that's what I have, a bunch of banana seeds. Uh, hmm. Honestly, it's just kind of garbage. I mean, I don't need any of this. There's my banana seed, restores 12 health, that is pretty crap compared to that. Alright, yeah, 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 I remember her. She has a charm from her mom, it makes sense. Yeah, he's he's not drinking coffee. <laughs> A little bit stronger than that. Uh, anything else? Okay. All right. Okay. Well, we now found out Sue's living arrangement, so that's checked off. Can now just get the heck out of here. And see Justin get punched in the head again.
Okay, so we just gotta go to the port, get an idea how to leave. But this is what I wanted, mostly. Okay, let's see if we can get rid of you, you, you. Find a better sword, get rid of a banana. Uh, they're never gonna use that. And to do Boom. Bah. herbs, get rid of them. Okay, that should be a lot better. Kinda. Justin's got most. Although, why you have the rock axe, I have no idea. Yeah. You just got the wound pile, toy bow, hand dart. Okay. Nifty nifty. Uh, any last words? Okay. Thought for a minute I got caught in another dinner scene. do that definitely just get all kit up okay uh, hand art she had she does have it I'm, I'm using something else uh, metal bat might be something nope So now she's got a bigger stick to whack people. Bam, better sword. Boom, boom. Yeah. Yeah, I don't mind her playing with the bat. I still feel like she gets more on the range side of things. Mm. The old armor is what I gave you. Fine. Uh, not huge difference to be honest. The movement speed's nice though. Mm. Yeah. Alright. And Sue gets a bow. Can't say I didn't look after her. Although I'm extremely poor now. Okay, well, the army said they were going to be pretty chill with Justin and Sue. They're not going to go chase them. They're pretty much free to explore, right? Yeah. She seems pretty happy. And I just ran out to the world map again. Yep. Get more lost than actually fighting anything too bad here. Directions are not my strongest. Oh, found that one. One of these signs must tell me. And I already went that way. I think if we just go over here, yeah. No, but it was on the other side with the, the goons here, right? Yeah. And he's just thinking in deep thoughts. Yeah, that's where we want to be. Eventually I find a way. Just stumble, trip. But eventually we get there.
Now who looks like they're gonna give me a ride? You're a sailor. Java. Yes, that sounds familiar. We have to get it at the cafe that looks more like a nightclub. Which probably is a nightclub. <laughs> uh, censorships. Always fun. Uh, yep. or someone just obsessed with seagulls. Uh, yeah. I think he's by the dock. Hmm. I'm trying to remember if there's anything else that we can really do. Get that recover just in case. Yeah, you look like the kid. Alright, then it's this one. Okay. That is done. Next we hand this over. I think we'll get some intel on the Java guy. Take us to, I want to say, a, some mines. We're not all the way done just just yet, but we're getting there. Yeah, I can get a beat on that guy. He, uh, he's got like the charismatic kind of attitude, but then he just says, like, ex not rude things, but he just like, know your place kind of attitude. <laughs> At least Justin's still in his mind, trying to murder him. All right, we're trying to get to the coffee shop, wink wink, nudge nudge, coffee shop. 
Now, if I see a bunch of girls dancing in the coffee shop, I'm going to have some questions about the establishment. And that's a very fun-looking coffee shop, huh? Uh, I know someone being kicked out. Yeah, marriage, always fun. Is that guy still playing hide and seek? Wow, he's committed. Hmm. At some point you got to ask yourself, are you really good at playing a hide and seek or maybe people just don't want to look for you? Oh, too much coffee? Lily the Skull would just repeatedly beat me. Good thing she's not around anymore. How's your mother? Mm, yeah. It's a coffee shop. <laughs> 